What is up guys? Welcome to the Big Unbox where we do that small tech and today I am back with another Say it with me guys Big unboxing for you for the iPhone 10 and we're back with that really thin case or at least it's supposed to be really thin case from the actual title This is from totally thinnest cover premium fit ultra thin light slim Minimal anti-scratch protective case. That's a mouthful for the iPhone 10. It comes in quite a few different colors and I got the gray one I believe. So it comes in gray, jet black, burgundy red, like a, a deep green, um, navy blue. You got matte black, jet white, and then frosted white. So quite a few different colors. The pricing is a little bit high. It says $16.99. This one's going to be like an ultra thin case. So if you're just looking for a minimalist case, this may be the way to go. That just basically protects the phone from scratches, but you really don't need any other protection besides that. This may be a way to go. Let's go and check out the packaging itself. Nothing really to it. I'm not sure. This is actually what it comes in. Totally. There, that's it. So let's see what else we get. I think you have to cut it open here. So for $16.99, I mean, that's a little bit pricey for a real thin type case. A thank you card, that's a nice little added touch. Let's see what we get here. Carefully packed and inspected to your warranty. That's a nice little addition. And then they do give you actual packaging inside of this as well. So totally, and that's pretty much it. A slim and minimal iPhone case. I can tell you just this feels like there's nothing to it at all. So that I'm not sure how much protection you're getting, but again, if you just need a case to protect you from scratches, this may be the way to go. Let's check it out and see what you're getting, guys. I got the gray, and you can tell that's like almost like a matte smoke color, which I do like the way that looks. And this provides no bulk at all. I mean, I can just tell you there's nothing to this. This is so lightweight. It's almost like a it's like a hard plastic, but it does provide some flex to it as well. And you can kind of hear it. So it's definitely not a rubber type it's kind of like a hard shell but it does get have some give to it as well it doesn't feel like it's going to give you a lot of protection but then that's pretty much expected and again i do like the way this one is it's, it's gray but it's actually going to be able to show off the back of that phone a little bit it's going to pop it in and see what we get i do like minimalist case sometimes i mean obviously this isn't going to provide you a lot of drop protection but well, actually i like the camera cut i'll check it the first things first so it shows off the back. Check. That's beautiful. Got the Apple logo popping through. iPhone. And I can tell you right off the bat, there's no bulk. This is almost like it's nothing there. So this is a very, very slim case. You're getting a little bit of camera protection. Not crazy, but they did raise it up a little bit. You can see the edges raised around, so it's not going to be flush. So you are getting some camera protection. So when you put it down, you're not going to have to worry about just scratching the camera up. So nice job there. I would give him props for that. Let's check out the actual lip protection, which probably is minimal to none. And as you can see, there's no lip protection. So my screen protector is actually kind of over the case itself. So you're getting zero screen protection. So if you drop this bad boy, you better hope you get a screen protector on that because it's definitely hitting that screen first. There's nothing on the edges that's going to protect it. So this was zero lip protection. Cutouts are exposed. You can see they're all exposed. So you, easy to get to for the kind of alert slider. Volume up and down. Clicky because there's nothing there. And if you guys like, I kind of like to have them covered up a little bit. That's just me. But again, it provides no bulk at all. So this is basically just going for a minimalist look at all, as well. The speaker grills are protected. Does look nice and precise cutouts. Power, precise cutouts. Top. Is cut it is covered as well so I do appreciate the fact that the top and the bottom are both covered up sometimes when you get some of these basic style cases they leave those two exposed and at least right now you're getting drop protection for the top and bottom and again exposed so overall give you guys a look at this case one more time I would say this one's a mini hit and the price needs to drop I mean this is not worth 17 bucks if the price is $10 or less, I'd probably say this is a big hit because if you're looking for just a basic case that's going to protect that back, this may be the way to go. And even if you want to spend a little extra money and get this, that may be the way to go. But I have a feeling there's some better cases out there that give you a little more protection for the price point. Let me know what you guys think in the comments section. 
Is it a hit? Is it a miss? Hit the subscribe button. We'll see you guys next time on the Big Unbox. We do it big, guys.